Ripple XRP 32 cents next likely Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocker from Rockstar Trading Channel. In today's video guys, I'll be sharing with you my price prediction and technical analysis for Ripple XRP. I'll be talking about some of the news that's been going on with XRP, some negative, some could be really positive news for XRP. And then guys, I'll share with you why I think XRP could be reaching that. And finally guys, at the end of the video guys, I'll share with you my trading strategy to make money if we do have a breakout and a move towards the 32 cents. My previous two calls worked really well and they're not after the fact. I made those calls before it happened. You can scroll back and watch my videos. I made a video on XRP, uh, sell XRP. I'm selling all of my XRP. That was around the breakout of this and xrp had dropped about you know 36 percent this is where i bought xrp there was a huge weekly divergence and i was posting if you've not subscribed to my channel guys make sure you subscribe to my channel and ch follow me on youtube facebook or wherever guys i leave all the links below xrp had some nice breakouts of these patterns and we traded them traded them very well so xrp is now back at a very interesting zone so i talked about my target being 19 cents for xrp and that target was hit i made this video let's have a look when i made that video it was a while back it was last year the 19 cents it hit 19 cents actually went a bit lower i actually bought some at 19 cents but it's coming to a very very interesting zone guys where i think xrp could have a nice pump if we can get above this so that's sort of my thoughts on xrp and i think you can see 32 cents is at the 3282 uh, fibonacci level if we can break out of that 236 fibonacci level uh, that can have another 20 20 percent 25 percent pump and it, not only that guys if we pump above and we can stay above that 236 fibonacci level xrp can have a huge move up there are some news that could be affecting as well which i'll be talking talking about now and then i'll share with you how i'll be looking to trade this pattern to make money from this so a not so positive news or whichever way you want to take it take it guys i'm sharing with you all all the key major issues with xrp i know a lot of my subscribers are xrp fans and um, again I, I talk about xrp in positives and negatives as well and i'm more of a trader i want you guys to be informed there's thousands of uh, hundreds of other youtube channels that will tell you one to what you want to hear that xrp is going to go to 10,000 20,000 or whatever guys on this channel i'll share with you all my honest opinions and let you make your decision i'll tell you what i'm doing and you could again uh, try to learn from me and follow what i'm doing but I'd, I'd i'd give you the the honest opinion i'm not trying to show you xrp for views or trying to sell you stuff so ripple cto isn't worried about xrp securities lawsuit as per cto david schwartz ripple's high profile law lawyers will take care of lawsuits with their strong words ripple labs had filed a notice of motion on feb january 15th which tells the other side about ripple earlier motion to dismiss the lawsuit so we know there's been news coming out that Bitcoin and Ethereum are not uh, securities because they're decentralized there's uh, but for ripple that's not really come out because xrp is the cryptocurrency and ripple is is the company behind it and although ripple claims that xrp is completely decentralized and xrp can run without ripple there are uh, there are misconceptions if you want to call it or there are you, you know people there are worries that that is not actually the case and xrp can uh can could potentially be decentralized with with ripple uh, there, there's there's arguments for both sides I'm, I'm not an expert in blockchain to make up my mind um i'm more that's why i'm trading and i love what ripple and xrp's goal is with cheaper cross-border payments but if it is a security that can have some negative impact so please that do bear that in mind this pretty much implies that the company that has been accused of running an illegal ico isn't worried about its legal woes ripple labs had filed a notion on january the 15th which talks about the firm's earlier request to dismiss xrp securities lawsuits that was filed 4th of december the talk uh, the attorneys with these best words are none other than kathleen r harnett uh, damien j marshall who belong to new york new york law firm um this is the law firm that they're from not only have these two attorneys represented 
uh, the crypto giants in the pending case but one of the founding members of the law firms happens to be David Boyer is one of America's most widely recognized lawyers so they have got a very strong uh, lawyers team so well, that that is a news that can have a huge impact if XRP if, if it's found that it's not a securities I think XRP can have a huge move up that 32 cent uh, breakout next likely thing is going to be blown out of the water I think it could pump to uh, 50 cents one dollar very soon if it is the, if it, if if it is found out to not be a security so we'll have to wait on news for that a really positive news ripple sold zero xrp crypto on cryptocurrency exchanges in quarter four so one of the uh, my negatives for ripple had been X, ripple selling xrp i know they need to sell some for their fundings or whatever but whenever ripple sells xrp that means that the supply of XRP is high and again if you are I'm, 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 I'm a trader and for trading point of view you know whenever supply is high the price goes down so if Ripple is selling XRP the XRP supply is high the chart is basically demand and supply back in 2017 the demand for cryptocurrency was huge that's why we went up like crazy since then the demand has died off and the price has been dying off whenever we see demand coming back in we, we will see huge moves up so this simple uh, I, I teach a simple trading strategy guys I don't teach uh, I know I do a lot of complicated stuff but when I share with you I try to share with you a simple strategy as possible it's basically demand and supply below this red zone guys there's a lot of supply people will be worried and that's why the price could not potentially be going up so ripple not selling xrp is a huge huge move uh, for xrp and it is a very big uh, positive for xrp ripple says it sells xrp to help fund its business and, and to invest in blockchain and crypto startups through its fundraising and development arm x spring the company raised 200 million last month in the series c funding round uh, led by tetragon with participation from sbi holding and route 66 ventures so it's a very positive news for the xrp community this is not so uh, positive to ripple derivatives contract to be delisted from bitmex uh, but we are getting xrp direct as an ongoing effort and improving offerings and experience for users effective friday 31 january uh, ups and down uh, contracts will be delisted existing bitmex up bitmex down contracts will be settled at the time as usual and new contracts will be listed from the time onwards so it's not really positive or negative it's just these up and down contracts that are unique to the platform exposing investors to underlying assets volatility allowing them to tap profits when pro prices are rallying or conversely gain when prices are dumping so what is the new uh, quanto swap is uh, designed purposefully for traders to speculate on prices of xrp usd without necessarily depending on usd towards this end xrp will be quoted in, in usd but the settlement will be done in third foreign currency at a particular rate this way the ramp re re reduces exchange rate risk especially on investors who cannot buy desired asset in their homeland a currency in this arrangement risk including fun funding rates are factored in and losses and gains made by the asset is mirrored by the derivatives product so that is just a news again neither positive not negative just a news i want to share with you guys especially if you're trading on bitmex like myself i do scalp a lot on bitmex but especially bitcoin showtime for xrp uh, bis exec calls cross-border payments a top priority so these are some positive news we always see I'll, I'll let you read it i'm not gonna get too much into it there's hundreds of other youtube channels talking about it i recommend you read it yourself guys rather than relying on on other people so those are the key news i wanted to share with you guys so now let's go back onto the chart and share with you how i am looking to trade xrp so first of all if you're new guys what i'll do is i'll wait for a close above the red zone if we can close above the red zone and above the and the, why is the red zone so significant guys there's previous support and resistance here it's the 20 moving average weekly 20 moving average you can see how the price have halted here once twice it's, it always happens this is a very basic things of charts one of the first things i teach i recommend you check it out I'll leave all the links below guys 
and and it's also the 236 Fibonacci level you can see it perfectly hit the 236 Fibonacci level then it moved down so it's a huge level guys if XRP can get a daily close above there you could look to buy some and have your stop loss below if you're just you know long-term trading uh, the way I trade I try to trade the shorter time frame that is my main skill Um, on the daily you can see it's also finding support on the daily 20 moving average I'd love for it to hold this support it's very important to hold this support in the shorter time frame if I hold this support I might be taking a long scalp in XRP you can see there's a, some uh, support and resistance here so I'd be looking to take a trade here if it can find some support if it breaks below this guys um, I'm not going to be too interested in XRP and buying XRP I might look to buy some at the 20 cent level you could see there's some support here I could look to buy some here if we go below the 20 cent level guys I think um, XRP might be going lower and my target might not happen so what needs to happen for my uh, 32 uh, cents prediction to to happen or to come true it needs to close up close above the 26 cent if it if it has a daily close above the 26 cents you can look to buy XRP and why do I think it can happen Happen. another reason is the Bitcoin chart Bitcoin chart is finding some support here we have seen XRP double bottom and then rally hard we've seen it here guys double bottom move up we've seen it in the past as well back in 2018 double bottom and move up hard so what I'd love to for I might make another video on this what I'd love for it to happen is a big spike down everyone moaning on Twitter oh ripple is dead ripple is going to zero then mess it I was gonna swear there well I might swear anyway mess everyone up and then move up that could be happening and when XRP BTC and XRP USD both charts are moving up that's when it's the best time to be buying XRP so that is my my thoughts on XRP and how I'm looking to trade it uh, the way I trade um, that's sort of my suggestions if you're new and not that experienced in trading if you're more experienced in trading the way I look to trade is I wait for a break above on the daily then I'll go into the hourly guys then I'll buy a pull back to the 20 moving average I've shared signals uh, in the group uh, I, I, I ran a course last year I'll be doing another one in February make sure you subscribe if you're interested um, I'm just making my websites and get, get, get getting everything ready to run another group I'll let you all know when I do release it and the way I'll be doing it is the way I'll be trading uh, I'll be uh, trading it is when it breaks above I'll wait for a pull back to the 20 moving average you can see examples of it here you know built 20 moving average then it move up you, you see a lot of examples like that it happens even before this pump it happened uh, here it also moved up so there's lots of opportunities so I'll wait for it to get above my 20 moving average maybe buy a pullback and see if it carries on that will be the in brief my trading strategy but if you're interested I'll leave links below if you want to find out more about my strategy but I've also shared with you if you're not trading um, how you can take advantage of it and potentially a couple of news that I've shared especially this news is huge news Ripple not selling XRP if, if, if it carries on guys that can be a big big news for XRP so hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video if you have enjoyed it guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button I will be running that live course again back probably in February sometime I'll let you guys know once it's all done similar to what I did end of last year so thank you very much guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button if you want to stay up to date i do a live stream every sunday i'll be doing one next sunday so if you're interested make sure you turn on the notification button so you get updated my question to you guys is what is your thoughts on xrp what do you think xrp can hit that level in the next couple of months the 34 32 cents of my prediction or do you think xrp will go lower comment below your predictions and let's have a discussion again this is more from a trading perspective i've made videos on investing in xrp i recommend you watch my top 10 videos where i talk about more investing i share with you my investing strategy if you're looking more to trading guys this is my sort of strategy if you're not new you know wait for it to close above and then see if you can ride it take that trade and have it move up if you're more experienced then you could use my trading strategy or you can learn my trading strategy which is a pullback a trading strategy to make money trading bit uh, xrp and any other cryptocurrency or other markets like gold or stocks uh, to make money in the short time frame so thank you very much guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much and go XRP